In this video, I will show you how to use World Download Module. We will try to download this Obsidian structure into our single-player world. We will use Exploration Mini Map Module to assist us. First, I will create new single-player world. Or, you can use existing. We will call it Download. I make it super flat just for demonstration purposes. Now we need exact name of our single player world directory on the disk. Go to your Minecraft directory and open saves. In our simple case, directory has the same name as we entered in game, download. I go to world download module, enter directory name and click start. If everything is fine, Start button should become disabled. Now I join multiplayer server. On the mini map, I can see dotted squares around downloaded chunks. I fly around to download more surrounding chunks. That should be enough. Now I disconnect from the multiplayer server and click Stop. Clicking Stop is important, as it releases file locks and finishes changes in single-player world files. Now I start our single-player world and teleport to the same coordinates as on multiplayer server. As you can see, all chunks here have been copied from multiplayer server. And here you can see border between downloaded chunks and our super flat chunks. Now I show you more complex example. We will copy chunks from custom dimension into our single player world. First, I will add this line to status overlay script to see what is current dimension. I will join random shitty Russian server for demonstration. It allows joining without official Minecraft accounts and thus they are violating Minecraft EULA. So it should be okay for me to not follow their rules. As you can see in the top left corner, we are in Minecraft Overworld dimension right now. After joining specific server, we are in the custom Minecraft spawn dimension. Chunks have been downloaded. Let's see what we get in our single player world. I am teleporting to zero coordinates. As you can see, chunks from server lobby, which was overworld dimension, were downloaded to our single player overworld dimension. To move chunks from spawn dimension into overworld, we need to copy region files. Minecraft stores chunks for other dimensions under dimensions directory. We can see here Minecraft spawn and four region files. I am copying them into region directory in the root. This directory stores overworld dimension. Let's see what we get. As you can see, we copied spawn region from the server into our single player world.